in the Netherlands. And uh, uh, the Netherlands is, the, is, is a really small country. Uh, however, it's the second highest density in population in the world. And it, also, it has about 17 million people in less size than South Florida water management. So it, it's, uh, it's, it's very heavily urbanized. And, uh, and since they've been doing this for about a thousand years, there is nothing that is natural there. Everything is man-made. And, and so um, even the rivers are, uh, are halfway man-made, as you'll see. Okay, this is, there's, there's three river systems there. Two of them we're going to talk about. One is called the Rhine, and everybody's heard about the Rhine River. It starts in Switzerland, it goes through Germany, goes into a little bit of Belgium, and then comes out uh, in, uh, at the North Sea uh, in, in the Netherlands at Rotterdam. The Meuse is, starts in, in, in France, goes through Belgium, and then the two rivers kind of combine. They didn't a thousand years ago, but we fixed that. And, and so now, now they're combined, and they, they both end up going out to sea at, at Rotterdam. And you can see here, uh, this is kind of the conversion area where the rivers uh, come together, and these are some of the towns that are, uh, uh, this is a conversion area. Uh, and actually, the Rhine is right there, but the water's mixed. It, it's, you got it, and the people who have been with us over there, they kind of understand that. Okay, the program is, uh, there's a reason for it, and uh, I'm going to skip all this because uh, we don't have really a whole lot of time, but there's a reason for it. And the reason is because of the fact that they have man modified this system so much. So if you got a, this is a, a kind of a, a, uh, a map that shows that this is part of what would be underwater in the Netherlands area if it wasn't man modified. Because it's 46% under sea <coughs> and then there's a huge amount of water danger that comes from floods from the river systems as well as, as the sea. Now, down in, in Switzerland is where the Rhine begins. This is the watershed uh, for the catchment area for the Rhine, and it comes up through Germany and then cuts a little bit into Belgium and ends up in, uh, going out to sea at Rotterdam. Here's a really interesting uh, little fact, and that is, is that the Rhine is so big that uh, the entire water supply for the whole country for one day the entire water supply for the entire country passes through a single point in the Rhine in 90 seconds. And so it, it's, it's, that's a lot of water. And so uh, at, at its peak, it's, it's uh, uh, 16,000 uh, cubic meters per second. Um, and so uh, one of the problems, here's the whole problem in a nutshell that they had, they're faced with. You've got to protect people from floods because when the snow melt comes from the Alps and, every, and the snow melts in Germany and it just keeps going down the Rhine and the Rhine gets higher and higher and higher, how do, how do you protect people that live on the side of the river? Well, you put dikes around the side of the river. That's logical, right? Okay, so, so whenever you dike the river and you put the dike right next to the river, then the river has no room to spread out. So in high flood stages, the only way it goes is it can't go sideways. It's got to go downstream. So what that means is that the, lar the, most, the single uh, uh, most important port in Europe and the second largest port in the world is Rotterdam. So whenever the spring snow, if you've got a really bad spring snow, snow melt, all that water ends up in Rotterdam Harbor and it's $2 billion of commerce going on there per day. And so they had to do something because Rotterdam was getting slammed. And so they decided, let's see if we can't make room for the river. And so you get, you get the idea of what the problem was. If you direct all the water into a little, a small, relatively small channel compared to the rest of the land, then you've got a problem at the end of the river, which is going to be a mess, which happens. Okay?